Hi, young people. Well, you can't make this up. See the tow truck loading the little car because it broke down and he's trying to help? Or do you see the tow truck parked in the middle of the freaking lane and this car coming down the highway and doesn't see the tow truck? Here we go. Right there now, 10 50, 10 50 rollover. Guys, he's taking the EMS immediate roll. They don't show any carnage or anything. It's Previous just uh, 84 West. Good. So I tried to see where this one was coming from. So she's way back here. I think she's overtaking this car. Maybe texting. She's 21 year old female. She's in the fast lane. And the speed limit, I think, is 65. So she's back here behind this car, obviously overtaking. And she does end up impacting this car a little bit. Doesn't cause a crash, but she does hit the car. So the impact is right as she lands. I think the rear bumper is touched, according to the police report. I think they give a slow motion version here. So, it looks like maybe at the last second here, she sees it and tries to go around it, but it's too late. So, where did she see it? I'm trying to look at the angle of this car here, because when you hit your brakes, you have weight transfer, and all your weight goes to the front wheels, and it goes down. So, it looks like her car is pointing down now. So, it looks like she probably hit her brakes here. Let's see if I'll show her car. She might be breaking all this time right here. Okay, so I can't tell if it's the angle or not. Yeah, I can't really tell. I was looking to see if the car... Maybe the car doesn't look like it's breaking right here. She might have noticed about right here. Hard to tell. It happened pretty quick. Turns that wheel, which causes a little bit of oversteer. She oversteered what the car could do, and her, she's starting to lose her rear end right here. Actually, the, the truck saved her from fishtailing, straightened her out. So, right about now, she's thinking, damn, who can I blame for this? Anyway, I digress. So it really doesn't say what her injuries were. Uh, motorist got behind a ramp. Sedan launched in the air. 120 feet before the crash. Tells where it's at. But it looks like they got part of the police report here. And according to this accident report, driver number one, for those who don't know, in a police report is always the at-fault vehicle. So if you ever see a police report and they don't say, well, we don't say it's fault. We just do the report. Whoever driver one is, is at fault. Okay, that's all, all agencies do that, I'm pretty sure, unless they've changed it. So, vehicle three is just driving along, vehicle two is parked. V2, V1, V1 at fault, V1 at fault. Comes here, hits tow truck, launches. Looks like there's a secondary impact here from vehicle one and vehicle three. Vehicle one rolls over, vehicle three continues down the road and pulls over. So, uh, speed limit 65. Doesn't say what her serious injuries are. Emergency walked up the tow truck, flying debris. I thought it said in here she was a poor, distracted driver. It wasn't her fault. Something distracted her, but all right, whatever. Well, Annette, there. Keep your powder dry.